In this series of videos, I am going to teach you how to program in C. And these are the topics that I am going to cover. Now I am going to divide each topic into an individual video. So in this video, we are going to set up an enrollment for our C programs. Now to set up an enrollment for our C programs, we simply need to download and install an IDE. So what is an IDE, you may ask? IDE stands for Integrated Development Enrollment. It is a software package with the help of which you can write and run your C program. Now there are various IDEs, but the one that we are going to use is Code Blocks. Download link of the IDE would be in the description. So without wasting much time, let's get started. Now after you have downloaded the IDE from the link given in the description, we need to install it. So let's start installing it. Now this is going to take some time, so I am going to fast forward this video. Now as you can see our installation has completed, so I am not going to open code blocks. Now I am going to go next and finish. Now before I end this video, we need to open code blocks and tweak it in such a way that it will help us later when we start do the coding. Now let's open our code blocks. Go into settings and compiler. Now under global settings, global compiler settings and under compiler flags, you have to look for warnings and then check to see if this is marked. In our case it's marked so we are not going to do anything. Now after this we have to go to tool chain executables. Now here you have to specify the path of for your compiler so mine is already set. But if it is not there you can simply go in browse it. And locate your code blocks installation and go to Ming GW. Now hit enter. So in this video we have set up code blocks for C programming and from next video we will start writing our first C program. If you like this video then give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I will see you in the next video. Till then take care.